So in today's video, I'm going to introduce you to two different types of plants, very common, and you can find it in any succulent shop. And these two varieties, though it is cheaper, really beautiful once it grows to a full plant. And the first plant I'm going to introduce is this plant. It's called Echeveria Swan Lake, and it becomes light pinkish color once it's in full sun this was in shade when i bought it today and that's why the color is not that good this can grow in full sun or in partial shade and also best in pots as you can see there are two plants in this pot this has very attractive symmetrical leaves and it's going to be beautiful producing large heads 10 to 15 centimeter across this is only getting a short upright stem so you won't see a large stem on this plant and if you put this in a sunny spot it's going to be really nice so let's plant that one first and this plant grows very well in winter than in summer so though i am repotting it in summer it can grow in winter nicely so take all the dried leaves out before you replant always if not if it rains it rots and it gives bugs and also it rots the other leaves too take the excess soil out so it has two babies i think this is a good leaf propagation that's why I need to take few leaves out so that it get room to grow in this bigger pot. I'm not going to separate them. I just leave them together. And then tighten the soil. around so this is one plant so let's do the other plant look how beautiful it is sometimes I think that people put different names I got two different plants one the same name and it looks very different this is called pinwheel revolution and let's take all the leaves out from the plant all the dried leaves out first and if you take few leaves out it gives room for the plant to grow properly After cleaning the dried leaves and taking few leaves out, put the plant in the soil. If you can see clearly, this has two stems out from that plant to give me some flowers. I always leave the flowers until it blooms and after that, once the bees do their job i'll take the stems out because i'm not getting the seeds out from any of my plants so when you cut the stems you can take these little leaves out and put to propagate they will more easily propagate than these hardy ones and this is another plant that needs a lot of water and you can water them all year round and this plant is going to be about 10 to 15 centimeters across and will give a nice pinkish plant this plant is a good plant for your outdoor gardens for rockeries and the borders and it will do a nice job with nice colors and hope you got a clear idea about the two different plants swan lake and the pinwheel and have a great day and thank you for watching